We have had a ranch since I was 12 years old. Our family are hunters. Uh, we enjoyed the outdoors in every aspect. We think that it's a God-given blessing to be able to steward a piece of property that he's given to us, and we view this as his, and uh, want to take care of it for his glory. I'm Brian Mitchell. You're at Lodge Creek Ranch. It's a place that we've had since 2004, and it is strictly focused on wildlife management and improvement of the habitat. We were looking for a place that could have white-tailed deer on it. You can step outside in the evening. There, there may be 10 or 12 bucks out there. Kids just love it. When they purchased the property, they really took it and ran with it. The hardwoods on the place were very thick. Not a whole lot of sunlight getting to the ground, not a lot of diversity on the ranch. They started implementing a lot of the habitat management practices that were recommended for the place. They also added uh, prescribed burning to the system. This was probably burned three years ago, and again, two years prior to that, I think. It started to open up the understory and suppress some of the grasses and get some diversity even in the open areas. The, the, the forbs are coming up pretty good in spite of it being so dry. Deer love that, don't they? We have enjoyed uh, youth hunts in the past, and to see kids come up, maybe never been in the country before, or have never uh, gone hunting and shot a deer before, be able to experience that. All that is a part of stewardship. It is a real blessing to be able to steward a piece of property and, and take something that's rough, that has potential, and be able to have a vision laid out before you of what it could be. I think that's what stewardship is be able to pay it forward for the next generation to where it's a blessing for somebody else besides yourself.